presents underneath the Christmas tree. I know I've been. But you know, it's fun to receive presents, but it's just as much fun to give. And there are lots of kids who try to give all year round, not just at Christmas time. Mm -hmm. They're volunteers, and they want to show you how you can get into the act. Well, I just like singing and singing. I sing around the house and everything. What do you think singing does for these folks? Uh, I think it makes them feel happy that people want to come and enjoy um, us doing this. It makes me feel really good inside because a lot of these people don't have family members and friends to come and visit them and it feels like sometimes we're the only things that they have. The real spirit of Christmas giving can be heard in the voices of these student volunteers from Finneytown, and their gifts will last much longer than the holiday season. Many of these same students caroling at Drake Center spend Saturday mornings in the inner city where they have fun while making life better for others. When I work here, I can see what I've done. You know, usually some other places you're not sure what kind of impact you have or what, you know, the results of your work are. But, I mean, I just really like working with my hands and I like doing things like this and I get to do a bunch of neat stuff that I can't do at home. You come down here and really do stuff. You, you see that there's more to life than just video games and Nintendo. Nintendo and there's more you can do with your life than just sit in front of a TV. These students and others from many greater Cincinnati schools are making a difference and earning high school credits for their volunteer work. Not many people do it for that. It's just more for yourself. It's fun. It is fun and that's why these volunteer programs work so well for everybody. And the fun things to do are everywhere, whether you like playing with little kids or cuddling cute puppies. All I'm given is a couple hours out of a day, and I get to spend time with the puppies. I love dogs, and and plus I get to watch, you know, how happy these other people get just being with the puppies, and it just makes me really happy to watch other people be happy. So I don't know. I think everybody would get the same thing out of it. A caring smile, a warm puppy, a little bit of their time on a Saturday afternoon. These are the gifts these young people have for the folks here at the Alois Alzheimer's Center in Green Hills. When I first walk in the door, all, all these smiles go on everybody's faces. And I've been to this center quite a few times, and some people I've never seen smile. When I give them a puppy, they just uh, ride up their face, and they become real happy with it. <laughs> no biting. No oh, their face just lights up. They love it. And they'll sit there and they'll tell me about all the dogs that they had and how much they love them. It's, it's great. Young volunteers are making a big difference all over the tri-state. These Ursuline Academy students spend part of their school day in the pool at the Stepping Stones Center in Terrace Park. It's just really neat to be around children because children are so innocent and they won't, they don't judge, they just love you for what you are. They're so loving, they appreciate everything that you do. Little kids just appreciate everything. It's a, it's a, it's a real, it's a real, I love it, it's real good for me. There are hundreds of ways you can give yourself to others, but how do you get started? Well first you have to find what you enjoy to do, things you like to do. Then once you have that settled in, then try to figure out realistic, a realistic time period that you can work. See the transportation. Tiffany Chenault and other members of the United Way's Youth Action Council recruit area young people for volunteer work. This book lists more than 300 things you can do to make a difference. It's important you choose something you really enjoy. If you, if you like what you do, uh, you're more apt to stick with it. Uh, you're not going to um, have excuses for, for not showing up. Um, you're going to be real positive about going. Uh, you're going to tend to invite your friends to come with you, uh, and that will make it more fun for you. Copies of For a Good Time Call will be available in area schools and public libraries very soon. You can also call the United Way's Voluntary Action Center at 762-7171 if you think you might like to volunteer. Giving yourself can make a difference all through the new year.
Weren't those puppies cute? Yeah. They're <laughs> cute. Oh, I don't. I think those puppies brought a lot of happiness to that senior center. I think so too. Everybody loves puppies anyway. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to be back in the spring with another Kids Count special, so I hope you can join us then. And until then, for all of us at Channel 9, for all of us right here, happy holidays. Merry <laughs> Christmas. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Dashing through the snow in a one-horse open sleigh. O'er the fields we go, laughing all the way. Ha, ha, ha. Bells on bottle ring, making spirits bright. What fun it is to ride and sing a sleigh song tonight. Oh, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one horse open sleigh. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way.